Hey everybody, it's Jamie, aka The Bag Lady. It is Friday, September 9th. Um, today what I've got for you is a fun box. So we're going to have fun back box Friday. Oh, and um, I did list some stuff from um, my death pile too that I want to show you. So I'll have to like run away for a minute to grab that stuff. But anyway, let me back it up. For, for those of you that don't know me, my name is Jamie, a.k.a. The Bag Lady. I am a part-time reseller on Poshmark, ThreadUp, and The Real Real. By day, I'm a business banking loan renewal specialist. Um, so, just real quick, you guys. Um, last week, I talked about uh, the listing challenge that I had with Janet from Happy Hour Haulers, and I realized that I didn't give you guys an update. Um, Janet won. She listed, I want to say, 67 pieces. I quit at 49, um, but it was fantastic. It motivated both of us, um, and I even got into my death pile a little bit, to, you know, which actually made mom real happy because the death pile gets stored in her room. Um, so anyway, let me get on with this box, you guys. And if anybody wants to get in next time Janet and I do um, a listing challenge, let me know. So this fun box comes from Mechanicsburg, Pennsylvania. I ordered it, let's see, on August 30th. And it just got here a few days ago. So here is first look. I got the paper out. And here is a peek at the box. So let's see what I have gotten. And you know what, you guys? I'm <clears throat> filming in different places and trying different things. So bear with me. Um, so slippers, brand new with tag Madden Girl slippers. Um... Let's see. They don't have a price or anything. Do they have a size? It says indoor use only, spot clean, women's medium, size 7 to 8. So, um, I don't know if these are going to get listed or not because um, mom has a thing for slippers. So, next up. Ooh, we have a brand new with tag Lululemon sweatband. And I don't think that I'm going to list this. Um, and the reason being is I am packing up a box for my boss. Um, just a little thank you boss for, or box for being such a great boss. And um, I'm going to include this in there because she's one of those women that does for everybody else and not herself. So um, anyway, next up. Jessica Simpson fashion tights. They have, they were sold at Nordstrom originally $16. They were clearanced out, but these look like a really cute pair of pattern tights. I will most likely list these or donate. Not sure yet. This looks like Ray-Bans. So let's see what we got inside here. Did we get Ray-Bans? Oh my God, we did get Ray-Bans and they look like they are in great condition. Just a little bit dusty. Um... So, yep, I will be listing these babies for sure. I was just looking to see if it had the cleaning cloth in the case. It does not, but still, that's a great piece. Okay, we've got some Talbot's trouser socks. These came from the outlet. They do have an outlet sticker on them. They've got little bows and polka dots. Um... You know what? I don't know. I'll either keep or donate, probably. All right, we have a leather passport holder, which is actually really, really beautiful. It is by Via Lorenzo N26 collection. So I don't know if this is anything. I'll have to do my research. But <clears throat> it's a beautiful piece, you know. So I'm not mad about that. We've got some PJ pants. These are pink. These are J. Crew. They are size six. The tag is falling out, so these are used. They've got lions. They're pink. 
And um, I've got that other J. Crew pair of pants that are very similar to this in style, um, still listed in my closet. So not a bad piece. And we've got a CC baseball cap tie dye. It's a pony pony cap. Um, it's got the CC logo. Oh, and look at that! It's got this braided detail on the back that you put your po your ponytail through. I am not really a hat girl, um, especially now with some of the hair loss I've been experiencing. But anyway, cute hat. I don't know what I'm going to do with it. And we've got a Vera Bradley Iconic Compact Hanging Organizer in Lavender Meadow. It's brand new with the tags. It's got a little hanger here. Um, great piece. Little zipper compartment in here. So, yep, I will definitely list this piece. And the last item is this. I don't know what it is. All right, let's see. Okay, I don't know if this is like a tablecloth or what. I am not seeing any branding or tags or anything like that, but based on the size of it, I will probably throw this in a care package for Zach because I know that they've been they have been looking for stuff to hang over their closet door. I know they got a Bob Marley to cover one of the closets <clears throat> to hang up. But this one, maybe they might want to hang over the other closet since I don't have a clue what it is. And there's no tags to identify it. So let's see what I got or how many pieces I got. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. So I got exactly 10 pieces, but I think really I got 10 great pieces with the exception of this cloth thingy that I don't know what it is. But um, like I said, I'll send it to the boys. Maybe they can put it to use in their dorm room. If not, they can pass it on to somebody else. So let me run away for just one second. And I am back. So this is what I've listed from my death pile. This Vera Bradley, brand new with tags, travel pill case. I am not sure if I got this as a gift or in a fun box, but it's been sitting around for a while. Um, I haven't used it, so I listed it. Okay, next up are these Levi Signature jeans. These were Zach's. They are size 40 by 30. Obviously, they don't fit him anymore, um, but great, great pair of jeans, and they are listed in my Poshmark closet. The next up is a Not Your Daughter's Jean, Marilyn Straight. Now, these are a size 16 plus, and I'm gonna tell you guys, if I wore these pants at all, I wore them once or twice. My husband got them, my ex-husband got them for me for Christmas last year, and they didn't fit me for long. So I grew out of them faster than what I could wear them. So these are listed in my Poshmark closet. These are really actually like a new without tag situation. Um, next up is these Tommy Hilfiger size 16 jeans. Again, another pair of jeans that I only wore a couple times because I got them for Christmas last year and I was losing weight so fast that they only fit me for a hot second. So 
These are listed in my Poshmark closet if anybody is interested in them. And then I have this Blake Griffin Pistons jersey. It is a double XL. Blake is no longer on the Pistons, I believe. Um, but anyway, it doesn't fit sack anymore. So he said, put it up for sale, mom. And the last piece I listed is a triple XL. I bought this size by, Zach and I both bought this by mistake. Um, this is a Harris, Tobias Harris jersey. And it's the Motor City one. They did wear this version in a game or two. So this is a triple XL. It's all listed in my Poshmark closet already. Hopefully, by the time you guys see this video, I will have the, the items from my fun box listed. That's my goal. When I open a box, I want to get the pieces listed and have them available for you guys. Um, it's, you know, I, I need to get my side hustle back together. And Frank's barking at me. I don't know if he's got to go potty or what or if he just wants up here. Um but anyway, just wanted to talk to you guys a little bit. Um, I know I've been talking to you about my weight loss journey and everything. Um, one thing I don't think I've talked about a lot is the hair loss. Um, I don't know if you can tell from my videos, but my hair has gotten significantly thinner um, since I started this process. And say hi, Frankie, to everybody. Um, but I have been noticing if you see in the camera, like in the thing, like all these little bits sticking up, that is new growth. So finally, finally, um, my hair is starting to grow back in. It's going to take a hundred years, but, um, that is one of the side effects though of the surgery is, um, you can experience hair loss. Most people do. There are some that don't. My friend Marianne that had the surgery, she didn't experience any hair loss at all. Um, for me, it, good thing I've got a lot of it because it's definitely been coming out. Um, and I've tried everything, collagen, biotin. Now I just added zinc into my diet because, or into my vitamin regimen because somebody said that zinc will help with that. Um, and also... You know, getting all your protein in, getting your liquids and things like that helps. And, um, you know, sometimes I'm not as diligent as I should be about getting my liquids. Um, you know, I get my protein in every day. Um, I'm really good about getting my protein in. But, you know, the liquids sometimes, sometimes I just don't make it, you guys. Um, anyway, with that, I'm going to keep this video short. Frank's got to go potty, and um, anyway, you know what, you guys, thanks for watching, thanks for all the support, I will be back this weekend, most likely with a denim box, because I have one sitting here, um, I'm gonna, it, things are going to be a little bit spotty for the next week and a half, as far as content, um, my niece is coming in from Mexico, and I want to spend as much time as I can, as much time as possible with her. Um, it's been a couple of years since I've seen her and, um, so anyway, I just want to maximize my opportunity. We may go to, um, a biker party tomorrow night. It's over on the West side. Hopefully I'll run into cousin Debbie there. If I, if, if I turn up, um, it all depends how she feels when she gets off the plane. Um, but anyway, with that, I'm out you guys. Peace.